There is nothing accidental about this investigation as far as the death of this child. Today, we could finally learn new details about what happened to that little boy police say was killed by his own mom. You'll remember the death of three-year-old Daniel Thurio sent shockwaves through the community earlier this year. Police say he was first reported missing, but later found the boy dead. Officers believe he was killed by his mom and her fiance. Today, the couple will appear in court. 13 Action News reporter Marissa Kinnison joins us live from Sunset Park with what we could learn today. Marissa. Yeah, at, this at the time this happened, search crews spent days in and around this park looking for that little boy after his mom told police she lost track of him here. But according to police, she made up that story to cover up his death. Back in September, Daniel's mother reported him missing. But after search crews found his body near Lake Mead, she and her fiance were arrested and charged with his death. An autopsy showed ongoing child abuse. Today, Daniel's mother, Cassie Smith, will appear in court. This after admitting the little boy had been beat and had hot water poured on him the day he died. Arrest reports show she denies doing any of the abuse, but admits she let it happen. So again, today is the preliminary hearing. Essentially, that is a mini trial to uh, show that there is enough evidence against Daniel's mother. Guys. All right. Thanks so much, Marissa. A lot of people have been watching this yes. and uh, upset, obviously, at the situation and then the big search that took yeah. place at Sunset Park. Well, I think that's why so many people were invested. Mm -hmm. I spent the whole day watching updates, yeah. wondering if they found the child and then to find out, you know, what really happened to him. Sam. We'll be following that trial for you today. Well, what